Did you know that nearly half of all adults in the US have high blood pressure? That's a staggering number, and it can lead to serious health issues like heart disease and strokes. But don't worry, today we're going to tackle how to lower your blood pressure in just 7 days. Welcome back to the channel. If you're looking to take control of your health, you're in the right place. In this video, we'll explore some effective strategies that can help you lower your blood pressure within a week. Managing your blood pressure is crucial for your overall health, so let's dive right in. Presentation of problem slash challenge. Now, let's talk about the challenges many of us face when trying to lower our blood pressure. First off, diet plays a massive role. The temptation of fast food and sugary snacks can be hard to resist. Plus, many of us lead busy lives filled with stress, making it tough to prioritize healthy habits. Then there are lifestyle habits, like smoking or not getting enough exercise, that can really complicate things. These factors can feel overwhelming, but recognizing them is the first step in overcoming them. Exploration slash development. So, what can we do about it? Here are some practical tips to get started. First, let's talk about your diet. Incorporating more fruits and veggies is a game changer. Think of foods rich in potassium, like bananas and spinach, they help balance sodium levels in your body. Next up, exercise. Aim for at least 30 minutes of moderate exercise most days of the week. This could be anything from walking to swimming, whatever gets your heart pumping. Lastly, stress reduction is key. Consider techniques like yoga or meditation to help calm your mind and lower your blood pressure. Just small adjustments can lead to big changes. Climax slash key moment. Now, here's the big one, the most effective single strategy you can implement this week. It's cutting down on sodium intake. Reducing the salt in your diet can lead to noticeable improvements in your blood pressure levels. Aim for less than 2,300 mg a day, or even better, 1,500 mg if you can swing it. Start reading labels and choosing low-sodium options. You'll be surprised at how quickly you can see results. Conclusion slash summary, to wrap it all up, remember the key strategies we discussed, eating a balanced diet rich in fruits and veggies, getting regular exercise, managing stress, and reducing sodium intake. It's about consistency and commitment. Stick with these tips, and you'll be well on your way to better blood pressure levels in just a week. Call to action, CTA, I want to hear from you. Have you tried any of these tips? Share your experiences in the comments below. And if you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends. Don't forget to check out my other videos for more health tips. Thanks for watching, and see you next time.